Okay, next I have Louise, which is from Drive Me Bananas. There you are, there's Louise. How are you doing? Welcome. Thank That's you. That's for you. Thank you. Now tell me a bit about Drive Me Bananas. Uh, so Drive Me Bananas is an endless runner. I don't know if you've seen Temple Run, Subway Surfers, of Time Games. Uh, so it's pretty much you run or drive through the city, and then you can swipe uh, up, left, right, to avoid cars. That's the game. And then it's pretty, like, on other pretty similar games to it, very famous right now, like I mentioned, Temple Run or Subway Surfers. A uh, simple game for mobile users to spend a little time. Like Is it only minutes. a mobile game? Uh, yes. So are you one of the developers for this game? Uh, yeah, I'm the game designer. Excellent. So do you have a demo for us? Yeah. Or let's get going. Uh, I'll hang on to this for you. Let's see, is that gonna... No, that's not gonna work. You should be set. Okay, so we're going to look at a demo of Drive Me Bananas. Yeah, that's, uh, that's like the main intro of the game. The story is basically the monkeys steal the taxi of a driver, and then the taxi has these special powers. So you can stand, you can get flat. Um, so the idea is you go to the city, and the city starts to get crazier and crazier. You can go like, down the subway, or you can fly here. And then you can go down the subway, you can you will switch to beach, to country, to downtown, and then the game starts to go faster and faster and faster. And oh, then wow. the idea is to run, to drive as much as you can, pretty much. It's not so a pity. And then we have some power-ups, which you, like, uh, you, you can hear the slow time. And we have several power-ups that will help you go to the city, then as many bananas that you collect, you can buy more power-ups, you can upgrade your, like, your main mechanics, which are get up, get down, and they get, get really skinny. Like, uh, so we have also like um, here, inner purchase, which are these. And then you can buy all these power-ups, like, upgrade them, and then you can upgrade your main, morphs, your main mechanics here. So how long has this game been available? Uh, no, it's not, out, it's not out yet. Do you have a date launch set? Um, maybe. Around December, middle December, but it's not, uh, well, it's about. Yeah. Okay, so I know you're the game designer. What was your inspiration for designing some of the scenery in the background in that um, particular? Similar to San Francisco, and then the country, a little beach, um, has some European, and then some San Francisco websites. That was the idea. Is this the first game that you've launched or have developed? Um, no, so we started on Facebook two and a half years ago. We got 200,000 players in less than six months. You got 200,000 players? Yeah. Six months? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that was very good. Then we switched into mobile, and then we are like, we got some angel investment, and now they're going strong into mobile. Have you left the Facebook space and just completely dedicated to mobile at this point? Yeah. Yeah. That's smart. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's the way that's to go. That's definitely the way to go. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, are you, what other games are you looking to? to launch, or is this the first one from your company on mobile, or? Uh, this is the first one on mobile. We're looking to launch an puzzle adventure game, and then we're looking at multiplayer cross-platform. Cross That's the third game, so we have, uh, we always have like three on the pipeline, one close to launch, one middle, and then one like very early stage. Can you play multiplayer with this particular game? Uh, yes, actually you can. You will be able to that raise your friends, uh, either synchronically like at the same time, or asynchronic, like inviting, like I dare you, I run, and then you run to get my score. And this is a cross-platform game? Uh, no, not this one. The next ones will be this one, no. Well, this will be like Android and iOS. Android and iOS? Yeah. Yes. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Thank you. And we've got one question, um, one time for one question. So anyone have a question for Luis with Drive Me Bananas? Well, if you have a question for Louise, he will be around, so feel free to find him. I appreciate your time. Thank you, Thank you so much for coming out to tell us about Press Start Studios. Thank, Thank you. you.